In this video, we're going to be looking at how we can integrate project control and risk analysis in three minutes. So we'll look at how risk monitoring and control and risk analysis and management overlap during the project life cycle. So we have briefly five phases of project management, initiation, planning, launch and execution, monitoring and control, and closeout. Whereas in the risk analysis and risk management, we have risk identification, risk analysis and risk management and planning, and risk monitoring and control. Now we can see overlap on the planning, where uh, during the planning stage we have risk identification and we'll have the initial risk analysis and risk ma management. And then during monitoring and control, we have another overlap and we'll look at that today. So when we're forecasting project duration with actuals, what we'll see is the original project duration or baseline, it could be cost as well, and then we'll see a straight line that goes off, that varies off, and that is the actuals. And, and then we can see a triangle that comes off that visualizes the low base and high estimates for the risk analysis, and it's taking in, into account the actuals in the, in the project. So let's take a look, quickly look at the workflow for this. So we're going to create a schedule. We're going to assign risks to the project schedule and costs. And we're going to perform Monte Carlo simulations. And here we can see a tra uh, in the tracking view, uh, we can see the original baseline. And then we can see that very typical, uh, I will call it the cone of uncertainty that goes off that shows us the low base and high estimates for the uh, estimates at completion. Once we're underway, we're going to be monitoring the project. We'll enter in the actuals, and that can be done in a uh, third-party tool like Microsoft Project, or you can do it in Risky Project. And then we're going to perform the analysis again. And from that, we also determine forecast duration and cost for estimate at complete, taking into account the actuals. And then, this is an ongoing process uh, at every phase gate at, or during project reviews. We're going to repeat this monitoring, enter actuals, perform the risk analysis again at each phase of the project. So what we can see here is a visualization of the changing cone of uncertainty as we get farther and farther down uh, the project completion. And what we can see is A, we get an updated estimate, uh, estimate of cost at completion, at estimate of schedule at completion. Uh, and that cone of uncertainty is getting reduced and the range in, or of uncertainty is obviously getting reduced as well as we move up through the, through the project and get more and more actuals and performance data in the system. With that, thank you very much. If you'd like to learn more about Risky Project Software, please, please uh, visit us at www.intaver.com.